after the strip etch strip process in the workshop, the copper blanks have their copper track work complete, but they haven't got a solder resist at this stage. So the solder resist is created by flood coating using a screen print process, a photo imageable ink over the entire surface of the circuit boards. And then this is part cured to a tack finish by cooking it for 20 minutes in a low temperature oven. The photo imageable resist is sensitive and using a contact print process in the photomet room, it's printed under UV light for a few seconds to harden off the areas which are exposed by the UV light. And that is then developed and that produces the solder resist.